If it happens in St. Louis, the Channel 4 Newsbusters will break it first. No one else stands a ghost of a chance. So if you want to know, just watch Channel 4, baby. You better watch Newsbusters. Oh, who you gonna watch? Newsbusters. News can't hear you. Who you gonna watch? Newsbusters. News Louder. Newsbusters. News Newsbusters. News who you gonna watch? This is Channel 4 News at 10.30. Good morning to you, St. Louis. I'm Ron Burgundy. And I'm Veronica Corningstone. Since it's Halloween, the Action 4 News team thought we would recap some of the scariest stories of 2013. We agreed that we should start with America's sweetheart, Miley Cyrus. If you're not familiar with Cyrus, she's the character from Twilight that Hannah Montana turns into when the moon is full. Still, the youth of America loves her which makes this next story even more difficult to report. Poor young Miley has been stricken with a debilitating condition that sends her body into convulsions whenever the song Blurred Lines is played. The ailment is most recognizable in her rapidly oscillating hips and discolored tongue. We do wish her a speedy recovery. Uh, Ron, I just have to make a quick correction. Miss mm. Cyrus does not have a condition. It is called twerking. Yes, well, whatever it is, Veronica, we, we do hope that scientists find a cure soon. <sighs> Let's just move on, Ron. The made-for-TV movie Sharknado was without question the runaway surprise success of the year on cable, despite its ridiculous plot line. Joining us live now to explain why a Sharknado could never actually happen is Action 4 News Team meteorologist Brick Tamlin. Brick? Sharks are like dolphins, only meaner. Okay, I, I guess that's it. I, I just wasn't sure if that was it. Not sure that we really learned anything there, Brick, but thanks anyway. In other news, the St. Louis Arch has been placed on an endangered monuments watch list. The preservation group says the Gateway Arch could be in danger of corroding and that its unusual height and shape make it difficult to preserve. Action 4 News Team Brick Tamlin is live at the famous arch in downtown St. Louis. Brick? My God, Veronica, please send help. Brick, my goodness, what's wrong? Oh, they were right. This arch is leaning. It could go at any minute. Please call the National Guard. Call the police. Call Superman. Call Channel 2. Call anybody. Get some help down here right away. This thing could go at any minute. Brick, wait. Uh, you realize that the arch is arch-shaped, right? It has a curve shape, which might give the false appearance of leaning. Okay, great work, Brick, as always. Solid stuff. Apple unveiled its new mobile operating system for iPads and iPhones earlier this year. Reactions to EOS 7 were mi- I'm sorry? Oh, okay. Reactions to iOS 7 were mixed. Some like the new simpler color scheme and added camera features, while others point out that the self-destruct sequence seems a bit over the top. But those with bladder control issues will enjoy the advanced features of the new Twitter app. I don't understand, Ron. What do you mean? Oh, come on, Veronica. Surely you've a time or two held it a little too long, and then you laugh really hard at a joke, or, or maybe you sneeze, and you, well, you twitter in your pants a little bit. I mean, Lord knows I have. <laughs> Oops, I think I just twittered a little. The viral video of the year came from a comedy duo in Norway, of all places. What does the fox say? The music video for the song, What Does the Fox Say, has already racked up 120 million views. That's 120 million very lonely, very strange people. Still, despite the bizarre storyline of the video, the song asks a valid question. Dogs say bark, cats say meow, but what does a fox say? We sent the Action 4 News team Brick Tamlin to Forest Park to find out. He joins us now live. Brick? Okay, so I found a fox and I asked it what it said. I don't think it understood me and neither did its mother and I gotta go. Coming up next on Great Day St. Louis, which I hear is fantastic, mm -hmm. by the way. Prancer size. Turns out it is a real thing. We'll meet the creator. And last minute treat ideas for Halloween. Thank you so much for joining us this morning. We will see you next time. For all of us here at Channel 4 News, I'm Ron Burgundy. You stay classy, St. Louis. And I'm Veronica Corningstone. Thanks for stopping by. But mainly, stay classy. Thanks for stopping by. Stay classy. I'm Ron Burgundy.
Thanks for stopping by. Stay classy, Ron Burgundy. Hi, St. Louis. I'm anchorman Ron Burgundy. I like a vehicle that reflects who I am. That, that's why I drive the 2014 Chevy Silverado. Just like me, St. Louis, it's stronger, smarter, and more capable than ever. It's been redesigned from hood to hitch. The Silverado's available with a V6 or a V8. And if you're wondering, the V stands for fabulous. This baby offers best-in-class towing up to 12,000 pounds. That's like 48 of me. Can you imagine? I can. The 8-inch diagonal color touchscreen syncs up to 10 devices via Bluetooth, and there are multiple USB ports. I have to level with you. I don't know what any of that means, but I don't have to to know that it's awesome. It's the 2014 Chevy Silverado. I'm anchorman Ron Burgundy, a legend in bed. No, in the legendary truck bed of the Silverado. Can we do it?